Welcome back to Chamber Exchange, a TV show. Again, I want to thank our sponsor who makes the show happen, Bank Hometown. Uh, and on our second segment, thrilled to have with us uh, Nigel Belgrave. Uh, we're just commenting. We have been, been, been a few years uh, yes. since we've been able to chat in person, but uh, Nigel is the president of Pure Clean of, of Auburn. Yes. Uh, and, and Nigel, uh, great to have you here. And maybe you could tell uh, our, our, our viewers a little bit about, about your business. Okay. Thanks, Tim. It's a pleasure to be back. It's yeah. been a couple of years, yeah, but I'm glad yeah. to be here. Absolutely. So, uh, Pure Clean, we're a property damage cleanup company um, specializing in the area of water damage. Um, fire, mold, and biohazard cleanup. Um, and with water damage, what we tend to see is a burst pipe in the home, uh, people's uh, basements flooding, especially mm. on a day like today with yeah. the rain, so yeah. that kind of thing. So we'll come in, we'll extract the water, we'll get that out of the basement, out of the home, we'll then set up drying equipment, and hopefully within a couple of days get the home dry. Once in a while, the damage is extensive, so we then have to remove some building materials. Um, by the way, a drywall, carpeting, flooring, things of that nature. But our goal is to try and get the place clean and dry as quickly as possible. And again, avoid mold. You know? Right. Well, I mean, you, you, you see, you know, with uh, one of the things, uh, unfortunate consequences uh, of climate change is that, you know, this, this, this weather, violent weather, yes. drastic swings, uh, and people who previously were never impacted having, you know, we're talking today like flooding right. or wind damage, you know, a whole host of things oftentimes don't know what to do or who to call and you know, is it insurance, is it covered? I mean, you help navigate, do the assessment and help people navigate through a lot of that. Exactly, sometimes they'll call us directly. Sometimes they'll talk to their insurance company or their insurance agency. So we always make sure that those folks are in the loop as well. And you're right, a lot of times people are looking for advice and direction on what to do. You know, we do encourage people if you've got basements, especially field stone basements, common in New England, to make sure that you have your um, contents off of the ground. Um, if you're going to store stuff, put them in plastic totes, you know, so they protect them from the water. Because you're right, last year we saw a lot of it over the summertime with the heavy torrential rain. Mm -hmm. We saw that a lot of people got flooded basements for the first time in a very long time. Mm -hmm. So a lot of people were surprised by the amount of water that they received. So those folks who were prepared, some pumps, had things elevated, had the least of problems. And you mentioned, you know, the, the issue of, of mold. I mean, I think, you know, as science and research and, you know, health, uh, you know, issues in terms of determining people's health and, and things. I mean, right. The issue of mold is now, you know, increasingly yes. <laughs> recognized as something that can trigger or cause issues. So it's important to kind of be proactive and get ahead of that. And, and that's it. We do run into people who um, have mold problems weren't expecting it. Um, they don't realize it at first. They have health issues, um, cough and sneezing. Sometimes they uh, associate that with allergies. But then after a while, they're realizing that it doesn't stop. Mm -hmm. you know? And then they're calling some folks like us. We'll come in, we'll do a full home inspection, starting all the way in the attic, going through the house, all the way down to the basement. And what we're trying to do is just hunt down to see if they do have water problems, and if so, if that's causing the mold. So, right. yeah. And then we'll, t we'll give them a plan. So we'll talk to them about steps on things that they can do, things that we would do for them, all in an effort to try and get it remediated. Yeah, and, and that's, I think, a great uh, you know, point. I mean, the way I described it initially, I guess, is you know, you, people call you in reaction to kind of a consequence, but there's the ability yes. for PureClean and, and your company and your employees to proactively get out there when maybe people might suspect you know, there is a, 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 a mold issue. But I assume even proactively do an inspection to say, hey, here are things you can do to Prevent us. Yes, and, and that's it. So we provide the free inspections. So if folks will call, we'll schedule a time, we'll come on out. And like I say, we'll check it all out and tell them what they're dealing with and give them um, ideas and plans on what they can do to address it. You know, sometimes people are a little surprised, they're unexpected, you know, but we'll walk them through it every single time. Yeah. And then, and, and, you know, in addition to kind of the cleanup, there's also the ability to perform some of the work to, to kind of get it back to a good good report? Yes, and, and that's it. So oftentimes we are there to do the actual cleanup initially, but we also have to take a look at what's causing it so it doesn't have to return time mm -hmm. and time again. So we'll talk to homeowners, property owners about things that they can do if they need to bring in contractors or other folks to help them with taking care of the property. We can give them advice and guidance on that as well. Because you, because you don't want to be a regular visitor. We do right? not. We do not. <laughs> We're happy to help you out once or twice, but we don't want to be there all the time. Right, no. right, right. Uh, and, you know, we, we, we you know, talk about this with all our members. And, you know, your company, number of employees, uh, you know, what are some of the skill sets that yes. you need? 
uh, and if people are out there looking, uh, you know, absolutely, you know, yes, can... absolutely, yeah, and, and that's what's interesting about it because the environment has changed, so we are looking for employees. We're definitely a um, very busy organization, um, based in Auburn, Mass. Currently, I have twelve employees are looking for a couple of more. Um, the area that we're looking for is technicians, so we're looking for people who are able body you know, uh, generally physically fit. We mm -hmm. have to carry a lot of equipment. We most of the time work in individual homes, but we do do commercial buildings as well. Right. So every now and again, there are a lot of staircases to be covered. Right. You know? right. Um, and just looking for people who are looking for something where they can help folks. You know, we're willing to do all the training to get them up to speed on what they need to be able to do. But we're really looking for people with the right attitude, people who want to go in and help people, especially understand that for most folks that we deal with, this is their first time. They're um, taking on a lot. It's a right. very um, disruptive to their home. It can be overwhelming stressful. at times. Yeah, yeah, very, yeah, very yeah, stressful. Yeah, yeah. You know, so I want employees that understand that. I want to take the time to help the customer through what they're experiencing, explain all that they've got to deal with, but also make sure the customer knows that we're here to help. Right. You know, right. That's very important to us. Uh, and and a veteran-owned business. So you, yes. You're, you're yes. a veteran. You're, yes, uh, I am. I did four years in the Air Force, so had a lot of fun. I uh, was delivering babies in the Air Force. A little different than what I'm doing <laughs> now. So. Well, uh, <laughs> care and empathy are both are required. Yes, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Right. Without right. a doubt. Yes. Uh, and and so if, if there's someone out there out there who's potentially interested in saying, you know, uh, how could I maybe come to work uh, and, and, and learn more about PureClean? How could I join you? Sure. Great. Yes. So um, on our website, pureclean.com, there are many links to um, not just my office, but also to our employment page, which outlines what we're looking for. Um, technicians are primarily what we're looking for, but we do have um, positions in administration as well. Um, and there are other Pure Cleans in Massachusetts. I am one of five, so I do know that those folks are looking as well. So, And your region yeah. is? Um, my territory is uh, southern Worcester County primarily. And also anything south of Route 2 through Worcester County we deal with all the way down to the Connecticut and Rhode Island border. Um, but we do frequently go further. So I got a crew right now in Springfield and another crew in downtown Boston. So we do got get it. around, that's for sure. Got it, got it. No, that's, uh, it's, you know, Worcester County is the biggest county, I think, of all the counties. So yes. A lot, lot, lot of ground to cover. Well, that's, oh, that, absolutely. And I assume just also similarly if someone, if someone out there watching say, how can I be proactive? They can go on the website. And, yes, and, and we have a lot of information on what to do in, in, when an emergency arises at your home. Absolutely. We want to make sure people are taken care it. of. Yeah. Well, Nigel Belgrade, for the uh, owner of, of Pure Clean of, of Auburn, a uh, great uh, chamber member business, and want to thank you for your engagement and involvement with the chamber over the years. Thank you, Tim. Pleasure. It's always been good. The yeah. chamber has been a great organization to be with. Good. And uh, we're going to come right back for our final segment. Uh, stay with us. These days, you've got your hands full in life. That's why we help you bank simply and securely with tools like Face ID and Touch ID. It's why we make it easy to make purchases on the go and get cash back while you're at it. Why we help you quickly deposit checks wherever you are. And it's why we lend a hand with sending and receiving money right from your phone. So even when you're on the move, you can manage your finances. Bank Hometown. Unlock your potential.